Hi, in this video, I am explaining an online graphic designing platform called Crello. Crello allows you to instantly create designs for social media, blogs, marketing materials and other types of advertisements without any professional designing skill. It is also available as a mobile application, so you will get it from the Google Play Store and as well as from the App Store. So without any delay, let's start. First of all, launch your search engine and search for crello.com. From the result, choose the first one and you will redirect to the home page of Crello. Before everything, let's have a look at the pricing of Crello by clicking the pricing option on the top panel. Here you can see Crello is offering two kinds of plans. One is the starter plan which is absolutely free and the other is a pro plan in which they charge 9.99 US dollar per month. Almost all the features are available on the starter plan except these three features which include working with a team, get help online and also removing the background image which is accessible only for the pro plan. But one thing you have to keep in mind is that only a number of 5 downloads are allowed per month for a starter plan. So let's come back to the home. We can see many options on the top panel like create in which you can choose what kind of project that you want to create. Templates which is provided to surf on a wide variety of templates provided by Krello. Tutorials which contains a wide range of tutorial videos provided by Crello about various kinds of designing techniques. Features which provides a quick guide to various features provided by Crello. In order to create, save and download your designs, first you have to log into your account using the login option at the top right panel. If you are a new user, you can simply sign up with Crello by clicking the sign up button which is next to the login button on the top right corner. You can create an account using Google, Facebook and as well as an Apple ID. Or you can simply sign up by providing your email ID and a required password. Then click the sign up button. And that's it. You have created an account on Crello. After logging into your account, you will be only able to see your profile option on the top right corner of the platform and also options like home, templates and my projects on the top central panel. You can manage your account option by clicking the profile icon on the top right panel. You can edit your profile, passwords, subscription plans and more from there. Coming back to the home page of Crello that we are currently seeing. Templates which I already mentioned before, which is provided to surf on a wide variety of templates provided by Crello. My projects which contain the works that you have done before. Your designs will be auto saved in this session. You can access it later by going to my projects and from there you can manage your works and also you can redesign your previously done projects. There is a trash option provided to remove the unwanted projects but still you can access and edit the deleted projects by restoring them from the trash. Again going back to the home, a search bar is provided on the home page to browse templates with an ease. We can simply search and find templates using keywords and Crello will provide a wide range of templates as a result. By going down we can see various panels which include featured templates and also templates which are classified under heads like Instagram post, Facebook ad, posters and so on. You can simply choose the type of template that you want to decide from these panels. Okay, now I will show you an example for creating an Instagram ad image. For that, you can either search a template using the search bar or you can choose the type of canvas from the quick access menu. Here I have selected for an Instagram ad and you will be redirect to the Krellos work area. You can see the type of canvas and its resolution on the top panel. On the left side you can see various options like templates in which you can browse for the templates that you want to work with. 
photos in which you can search for stock photos and also you can purchase from deposit photos video option for searching short video templates provided by Crello the music option in which you can add music from different genres and also you can upload audios from your storage animation provides various kinds of animated objects and graphics object include thousands of stickers and graphics for design the background option in which you can search and add images as background images text option which is used to add text to your designs my files in which you can upload images or videos from your storage device so here i'm searching for a template for example i have searched for programming and as a result you can see Crello has provided lots of related templates you can see one by one as a preview and also you can choose one as your wish so here I'm choosing this one you can magnify with the magnifying tool at the bottom of the canvas double click on the text to edit here I'm changing the text you can change the font color using the fill option on the top left panel of the canvas also you can change the font styles and the font size with the text setting option you can move align and place any object on the template by simply clicking on it then move and place it where you want okay here i'm doing further more edits if you want to remove any objects from your design you can delete it by selecting that particular thing and then remove it using the delete icon on the top right panel of the canvas if you want to add any images or logos then you can simply upload using the my files option click on my files option select the upload image or video button and choose the file on your device then upload and place it where you need it after finishing the design you can preview your design using the present button on the top panel using the share option you can share your work instantly to social medias if you want to resize the design there is a resize button is also provided you can directly download the file by clicking the download button on the top right corner and choosing the required type of file to be saved or if you want to access it later no worries it will be auto saved and you can access it later from my projects and you can still proceed from there and that's all for now i hope you have enjoyed the video thanks for watching